The famous trend of putting a monkey in a box, you can only find this in a third world country. So here we have Tweedle Dumbass who just acquired an injured monkey named Lucy. This is the beginning of the fake vet videos, that have a lot of viewers fooled into believing that this vet is real. Since I already seen this shit over and over, of course the so-called vet is a fake, or I wouldn't be doing this video. Tweedle Dumbass overdoes it on the look at me caring for an injured monkey bullshit. Okay, so we are going straight to the vet videos. First thing, what the fuck is this, another fake setup of tools and yes the Betadine. These people and Betadine what a fucking joke. Apparently this vet is illiterate, because he has never read the directions on how to use Betadine. Nor did YouTube School of Veterinary Medicine cover that subject. Nice that he decides to put his gloves on last. He seems a bit confused with the order of where to start first. Well this proves he's a fucking idiot. Using these scissors to cut the bandage off, really though. No gloves and dirty scissors, I can see why people were fooled into believing this is real. Wake the fuck up people. Now the idiot decides to sanitize his hands, I was right this person is confused. Boy I hate to break it to you delusional fools but this person is a fake. So this fake vet has never in his life put on a pair of surgical gloves. I had to speed up the video, because it took him too long to figure this out. This must have made it easy for some people to realize in their heads, that this guy is legit. This was one of the most dumbest things to watch. I mean this guy is truly a fucking idiot. Now this side of Lucy's leg doesn't look that bad. But what happens next really does blow me away. This guy proceeds to make maybe an inch cut in Lucy's leg, and for what reason? He keeps squeezing it like some kind of surprise is going to ooze out. I see only blood. But he doesn't even numb that area first so you can imagine the pain Lucy must have been in and it's obvious by her screaming. Wow. 
To think, people really believed this was a vet, these are the same people that vote whenever they get that chance. So I never saw the person give Lucy that proper look over before he started, like take her temperature, check her weight her heartbeat. Now he's giving her a shot in her back which if not done right could result in something serious. So far everything he has done is wrong. The amount in which he's giving her and the location he is injecting her, tell me this person has no business whatsoever petting an animal let alone caring for one. The one person who would be perfect to explain everything in this video would be Aros Morisco. But how unprofessional looking at how dirty the surroundings are. That blanket is not sanitary and I think having what little tools he has on that blanket is only because he is proving he is a fake. This time she loses control and he completely fumbles. Another thing I noticed is that he never cleaned the area with alcohol before giving that to her. And where is the proper disposal for used syringes, I see there is none. Now what Tweedle dumbass does next, I mean fuck, it really didn't surprise me. Fucking disgusting. So it is true that Cambodians don't practice good hygiene, here's the proof. I wouldn't doubt that she wipes from back to front, after seeing this. Not only that but that garbage she tries to give Lucy, really though. That shit might be okay for humans but obviously Lucy is not wanting it. How could Lucy trust this idiot after everything she's been through? So there we have it, a massage table, of course. This fake vet doesn't have shit, but he does have one thing I noticed that you never see, toilet paper. That is one nasty injury, looks really bad like her leg was almost cut off. This idiot keeps putting betadine on it, I can't imagine how much that has got to burn. Poor Lucy, another monkey at the mercy of a bunch of idiots. So all this fucker does is basically cut open her leg and put betadine on a nasty injury that looks like it should be stitched up. Give her two shots and no one knows what those shots were. By the way Tweedle Dumbass doesn't call him the vet, she calls him the professor. I can't imagine he would be a professor teaching medicine or veterinary classes, he can't even put on fucking rubber gloves. There was nothing sanitary about the whole setup, he lacked in proper tools, he didn't give Lucy the proper checkup. I mean, come on, he did this all on a massage table, which probably has had enough happy endings in its day. Okay so here she is at the pharmacy, making it look good to the viewers, like she really is doing her best for Lucy. What a fucking joke, this is just another fake bullshit episode just like with Monkey Bido. So she gets a vitamin supplement and some antibiotic cream for babies, this cream is for minor skin infections not for an injury like Lucy's. Now after the fake x-ray even. Tweedle dumbass is just busy organizing all this fake shit for views. Well with that said, she is doing a great job at that. This was a bit strange, a short slideshow of Lucy laying there like she was supposed to get x-rayed but doesn't look like it happened. This particular video was very vague, and the comments were turned off. Maybe this is why. At the very end here we see a man holding up an x-ray of what? With that said he could be showing her an x-ray of his asshole for all we know. So it makes sense, Tweedle Dumbass didn't really get an x-ray, I thought there was another video of this x-ray, but of course I can't find that video now. So showing this at the end of the video was a good idea, because it confirms, that it was all just a bunch of bullshit. So as long as Tweedle Dumbass allows the other monkeys to drag Lucy around, I doubt that leg of hers will ever heal, in fact I will be surprised if it does. This woman has got to be the most annoying sounding insane train wreck ever.
Thank you. 